We are in Philadelphia on Friday the 13th at Gray Lodge celebrating their Friday the Perkinteenth event. suspects involved because every time I come, you know, I mean, I see the usual gang. There's always people I've never seen before coming and trying out this new thing. It's great. It's been good for beer. It's been good for the bar. I guess it's been good for me. <laughs> it's been fun anyway. We're open 365 days a year except for um, leap year when it's 366. There's always great beer on tap. Always great food. Friday and Saturday nights, of course, there's a uh, crowd. Oh, okay. Normally there's a crowd, but not of course, you know. Sometimes you put that thing. So, but yeah, it's a nice, fun vibe. People are um, friendly, even here now with everybody packed in and it's loud and people are all tight. Everyone's really very nice. This place is full of Philly fans today. Here we are at the Gray Lodge, here for the beer. Thanks for having me on it. 
at uh, Scotts' Friday the 13th. It's uh, one of the great events in Philadelphia. It's a, uh, a classic, very unusual event because of all the cast gales that he serves here. I think a lot of people uh, were first introduced to cast gale in Philadelphia through this event. And it's just insane. I mean, we're, we're here, what, at 2 o'clock? This is Jan. Nonetheless, this is a one of the classic events that makes Philadelphia such a great beer city. Um, actually, I can't stay very long. I'm really busy. I got a hell of a lot of work, but I'm blowing it off because I had to come down here for at least a beer. I'm doing the Dock Street Rye IPA, which I really love the beer, and to have a chance to try it on cask, definitely something I wanted to try out.